Oh, for real? How you doing, fam? Yeah. So, so you, what's up, man? How you feel, man? I appreciate you. Hey. Get... <laughs> you know how I feel. Fifty-five sitting. No, on 55, fifty-five mil. As we all feel. Facts. Salute to you, King. Oh, give thanks, and I salute right sir. back to you, good bro. What's good with you? Yes, sir. Oh man, I'm good. You remember the Gus days? St. Louis downtown. Oh hell yeah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that man. Was my only time meeting you, uh, cause I never uh saw you out in New York. You know, have very few uh visits over on the East Coast. Right. Yeah. Uh, old Gus passed away about three years ago. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, man. Yeah, yeah. Sorry to hear that. I mean, he was up another complexion, but I think he was still down for the call. Yeah, yeah. Was, you know, I mean, we gotta have allies, man. We gotta know how to choose him, though. That's all. Exactly, exactly. Right. Yeah, yeah. And he always treated us good. He always right. treated us good. But they done came over and took over down there, man. And it, it ain't even the same down there. Mm. But yeah. uh Okay. There's no knock to you, Fred, but what what I'm I, I really, really uh feel what you were saying. We are all the messiahs. That's why I dress yeah, all my sure. kings yeah. and queens in this chat as kings and queens especially when we hop operating on that higher frequency. We're always not going to agree with everything. And some things people say make, you know, make one or another suspicious because, you know, we, we got to get to grow and know. But uh, I give everyone the benefit of the doubt until, uh, you know, you prove otherwise and all that. So with all that being said, Professor Griff, because, you know, I know a lot of people want to call in. With all that's been going on with the turmoil that's been going on, you, you, you know about it, been hearing about all that in the news. Just focusing on the police shootings real quick. I, and I'm kind of like scared to ask you the question because it might go along, you know, go real long because you probably got a real in-depth response. But what would you say in the short version? What is the solution of ending this? Ending the shootings of uh, black people by police? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. there's some basic steps that we can take uh, right now. Of course, the longer version would be us having to get together to form um, uh, community policing. So just keep that concept in mind. There are organizations that are in place, whether they're religious, political, educational, or just straight up gangs or militia, or whatever, or FOI, or whatever. Those things exist in every city. I said if you, I said about an hour ago, we could have had a 1-800 number set up. 1-800-HELP-BLACK that we could call. So we ain't got to keep calling the police for them to come in and to deal with our affairs. You understand what I'm saying? So I'm about solutions and putting things in place, realistic things in place to, uh, to offer as a uh, offer as a solution. You understand what I'm saying? Um, yes, the idea of defunding the police, if you're going to defund the police, because I'm sure there's been a few times where I needed to call the police on a motherfucker. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? So defund the police, we got to replace that with something that's going to actually work. If there's a mental, a person with a mental issue, right? The police need to show up with the social worker. That's equipped to handle those mental issues that we're calling the police for right or wrong no you're right because i, I i'm i'll be confused about that if you get a 5150 call that that's automatically it's a mental issue going on so right. like you say why no why is there's no experts in in mental you know in, in a mental health uh showing up on the scene to right. uh, you know that's, that's what needs to happen that that these are solutions that i'm giving you and they they will work and it's something that we can do tomorrow listen COVID 19 hit and it seemed like the government of the united states put a trillion dollars together like that and started paying people six mm. twelve hundred dollars why can't we do it bro we can do it so we start tallying up the military industrial complex all right reparations to israel and other things there's money there bro there's money there to do. They just don't want to do it. And they're not going to do it. That's the short version. Right. Well, I appreciate that. That, that appreciate was still it. a very, uh, very well and respected response. Oh, and good. Thanks, good brother. Really appreciate it. Hitting, hitting on all cylinders, all cylinders. And uh, 
I believe the group, I know you know them better than you, but you know, when I saw y'all together, it, it was seen harmony, it was good energy. Didn't it? And I feel I feel deep down, you know, it that is resonating somewhere. I don't I, I'm not trying to change your mind. You know better than I do. But I mean, it's as everyone said, y'all impacted this whole nation and nations beyond this nation. It just started here. Right. But Africa, Egypt, well, Egypt and Africa same, but Europe, all over the globe. Y'all made a definite impact. Oh, give thanks. And y'all will always be cherished for that. They can right. they never take that away from you. Oh, give thanks, man. Thank you. We really appreciate it. And, and, and the last thing, somebody said, well, we need a hundred, Professor Griff. Somebody said, we need a thousand. I put in the chat, we need like 999 million. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, be free. I'm, free. I'm serious, man. If I have my own planet, You'll be you. You'll definitely be the gatekeeper. Fear of a black planet. Oh, don't make me the gatekeeper. There's a lot of people that might not make it, bro. <laughs> hey, 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 I'll be cool with that. You said it at first. They, they, they might. Not, that means they're not fit to be there. That's not being judgmental. About to go just get keeping, it, keeping it firm square. It's a place for them somewhere else. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> let me get up. Let me get up this <laughs> let, Make sure it's enough women there to to accommodate all all nine hundred. Uh, there's a lot of people ain't gonna fucking make it, bro. Oh man, <laughs> Terrence Bailey said, "I appreciate you calling it." And by all right, the, yeah, you. all the time. Yeah, he a good he a good brother, man. I started this barbershop mission, man. He sent me a barbershop chair, man. Oh wow. Okay. You see what I mean? You see what I mean? Yeah, yeah. This is a real community we building over here, man. And and whenever you feel like down on black love, black men loving you, mm -hmm. holler at me. Okay. Come right on, and and, and we're gonna refuel you because I know the because I know what you go through. You know what I mean? And and 